Hey everyone, welcome back to smart for home Today we're diving into the world of tech lingo, and we're tackling a term that you might have heard thrown around but might not fully understand, NFS. So, what does NFS actually mean? Stick around because we're about to break it down for you. First things first, NFS stands for Network File System. But what exactly does that mean? Well, imagine you have multiple computers connected to a network, like your home Wi-Fi or an office network. NFS allows these computers to share files and resources seamlessly, regardless of their operating systems. Think of it as a digital highway where files can travel from one computer to another at lightning speed. This makes collaboration a breeze, whether you're working on a team project or sharing photos with family members. Now, you might be wondering, how does NFS differ from other file sharing methods like FTP or SMB? Well, NFS is specifically designed for Unix-based systems like Linux and Mac OS. It's lightweight, efficient, and optimized for high-performance computing. NFS operates on a client-server model where one computer, the server, hosts the files and makes them available to other computers, the clients, on the network. This architecture allows for easy scalability and centralized management of files and resources. Setting up NFS is relatively straightforward, especially on Unix-based systems. With just a few configuration tweaks, you can have your own file-sharing network up and running in no time. Conclusion. So, there you have it. NFS, or Network File System, is a powerful tool for seamless file sharing and collaboration in a networked environment. Whether you're a tech enthusiast or just curious about how computers communicate, understanding NFS opens up a whole new world of possibilities. Thanks for watching.